Good morning ladies and welcome back to another episode. Today we're gonna put mega ultra realistic clears versus bright colors in mega clear water. This is up next. If there's gonna be any difference between those supernatural colors and those crazy banana-ass colors, it's gonna be today. Better fish. We're gonna have fine dining when High Mart is out on the water. Oh yeah, I'm sure dude. We're killing it, dude. Ooh. I'm gonna eat it. Looking good. At your service. Oh man, so excited. Make a jump for it. On the water again. All right, that's All right. right, my dude. Morning, ladies. Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to another spicy episode. I can tell you that we are more excited than we've probably ever been before. Yeah. Never ever have been this excited about a uh, film, a challenge, a fishing day on the water. No. You know, we have one favorite challenge of all times that we did like a few years ago. The first bright versus dark lures challenge. Yeah, and that got so popular. I mean, Hundreds it... and thousands of views. Then after that we did the uh, same thing but in muddy water. Yeah. But today we're gonna spice things up as yeah. much as absolutely possible. Yeah, today we're gonna do like the most ultimate uh, ch fishing challenge. We're gonna do ultra realistic supernatural lures versus ultra mega bright lures in super clear water yeah. and this water is no joke it's like gin clear right now we have 3.4 meters down to the bottom and we can like literally see the bottom yeah if there's gonna be any difference between those supernatural colors and those crazy banana ass colors it's gonna be today. Yeah, it's, it's basically it, it, gonna, it's be, it's today. gonna be today. Yeah. yeah. No wind whatsoever. No, and we are trying a completely new spot, so we have like no right. earlier preferences that could like uh, come in handy. We are just plan out going fishing today. Yeah, so excited. Let's uh, get going. Let's get going, man, and get to the fishing spot. Oh man, look at this clear water. Sick. Camilla, so do you want to start with bright or? Ultra natural. Um, I probably would want to start with this one. So do I. <laughs> yeah. But rock. Luckily, there is one easy way to solve this problem. Rock paper scissor. First one wins. Okay. Rock paper scissor. Okay. Boom. Here we go. We can choose for ourselves. Right. You're not gonna catch any fish anyhow. I'm not much of a fire tiger guy, so I'm, so I'm gonna start with this one. This would have to count as bright. Yeah, that's bright as hell. And I can't really make up my mind if I'm gonna do this uh, supernatural rainbow, or actually I think I'm gonna go with this one, the motor oil perch. What do you say? Start here. Yeah, that's let's good. do that. And then do the throwing motor. Yeah. Oh my god, just look at this water, dude. This will be so much fun. Ha! Uh, and look at this color. This supernatural. Oh, I mean, these are not painted. They are printed just look at this that's old school stuff this yeah. is new school stuff high tech but, uh, i'm still gonna beat you with this one but i'm not yeah. too sure at this time though I'm i mean oh look at this color motor oil base with printed perch stuff on it that's so sick let's this get is. to fishing dude yeah let's let's freaking do this we have some matching stingers we're gonna use these guys a lot today we should also mention that this video is sponsored by Obi garcia which we're super grateful for and it's gonna be super fun to try these yeah, man, I've, uh, I've seen a lot of big pike caught on the McPikes, but I uh, haven't used them so much before. No. Oh, man, the wind is not to our advantage today. No. I think we're going to have a lot of followers this today. Is, we need to change the name of this uh, episode to Follower Day. Yeah. Like, I know, clickbait, how to get followers. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone's going to watch it. But what do you think? Start here? Oh, yeah, let's do that, man. I think we'll start to fish our way into this bay. Oh yeah, look at that! Right here. That's so sick, dude. You know, the, we have weed on these islands here. Oh shit! Holy moly! Oh my god! How how did we never try this place before? I know that. All right, Miller. So today's rules: I start with this for one hour, then we switch. I go over to those bright lures, and the winner of today is going to be the lure color style that catches the most fish. Yeah. But we're also taking size in consideration. Okay, I'm all rigged up and ready. You I'm are. Soon, do you have a leader for me? Somewhere? Yeah, I, I have. It's in here. It's in here. When there's no time in doing a real leader, darts have you covered. Yeah, we're both using these ready-made four yeah. carbon leaders. Okay, so it's already 10 o'clock and the first hour starts now. We're having 2.6 meters, 8.3 degrees in the water. And yeah, this place looks really good. We have a bunch of islands and some weed in the like outskirts of a bay that opens up inside here. So this should really be a place where the pike gathers up, you know, in the I fall. So. Now we're in the end of October and the fish are, you know, somewhere between here and there. We don't really know. They are starting to migrate towards these shallower areas, but it can be a little bit wherever they want. We're just gonna have to find out really. Yeah, we sure need to. 
Okay, first cast of the day. That's cheating, man. I don't have a I'm not even rigged yet. <laughs> the timer started. You had the same time as me. Oh. I have full confidence in this lure, at least. I know that if they are here, they're gonna bite. Ooh. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, I missed one, missed one, missed one. Stop, stop, stop. Had a bite. Oh. You actually had one? I had a bite. You saw the whirl. Look at this. <gasps> good teeth mark. Oh. That was a good take too. Who knows what that was, but it was a good whirl. Mad. Oh. New spots. Running and gunning. Okay, let's go. That's the changing alarm. I need to head yeah. over to Bright Lures. Yeah, so now it's my turn to go for the, for the 3D printed ones. And I think I'm gonna go for the Roach. Oh yes, oh yes, oh yes, oh yeah. yes. This one is super cool. Pink trout, 25 centimeter version. Thank you, little perch, one bite. No landed fish the first hour. Well, well, just have a look at this, man. Oh my God, dude, that's so sick. I have big fish vibes about this. Oh, do this now have weed or fish? I don't know. Looks like weed. Yeah, weed yeah. Oh, that's weed. Oh, turn off. 3.1 meters. Weed. Got a little bit of wind. Okay, slow, slow, slow drifts in this direction now. So since I'm the one going with the ultra realistic now, I just changed to the rainbow pattern, rigged with a small stinger and a small weight. It's uh, 2.9 meters here, so it should work. And it like should work for real. Yeah. Oh. One out here. Oh. oh no. Well, there are fish here at least. So maybe we're starting to. Oh. Again. No, no, no. Oh, what a take. A good, good one. Oh, what a take. Tell on down, tell on down, tell on down. Fing found them, dude. Mm. Man, that sucks. <laughs> Lip it, it's mad. It's cool. Here you can see on the right side, that's the edge of this rock here, you know. We're fishing it effectively at least, thanks to the Minn Kota. I fucking quit. That was bite number two or three on this one. But it's only small fish. We can't have lunch until we've had the pike. That's official rules. Missed one again. Well for Team Heimat right now. Lost fish number five. Five? Six, maybe. Six. Ah no fish on the board. Soon as the full drop. No, there's a full drop. So we put it. I think it's cool to test the Fish on! Poisson! Poisson! First freaking fish of the day after like three hours! <laughs> oh yes! Finally! Holy smoke! <laughs> We're gonna lose it now. We're not gonna even see it. It's <laughs> yes, so good. Yeah! <laughs> it's like one kilo, I don't yeah. care. The grind was real to get Boy. that fish. We're so close to giving up and like leaving this place altogether when this huge pike inhaled that orange, red, black. That's the same color theme as you have. Ooh. Okay, get her up and uh, let's put the first fish on the scoreboard. Yeah, she's not a big one at all, but oh, she's making a mess over here, dude. Show me the money. This is probably 64 centimeters or something. First fish on the scoreboard. 102 bright lures. Yeah. But uh, I guess it has been it has been shining through that the struggle has been real this morning, but not anymore. Could have been a lot bigger than this, but I have probably caught eight kilo pike 
earlier in my life before and I haven't gotten this happy before. Awesome. Oh, dude, let's get it back. Oh, you have no idea how important you are for my self-confidence. Ciao, ciao. Yes! yes! <laughs> Epic. So we just declared that there won't be any lunch served in this boat until the first pike has been caught. Yeah, and now we're well, gonna uh, have some lunch, man. It's like 12.30 or something and I'm getting really hungry. Yeah, we have and something epic cooked We have today. something epic. This is gonna be... So, yeah, nice. let's uh, let's go and find a place and let's cook some lunch. Yeah. Okay, lunch time. Best part of a slow day like this. Yeah. Short lunch. This was too long time ago. Yeah. Thank you. Okay, Mila, see you in like 20 minutes. I'm gonna keep working in the name of science. Right, let's start with building a fire. Let it burn, let it burn, let it burn. Perfect, and today we're gonna serve something called Biff Rydberg. So we have the good old frying pan, some salt and pepper, or oh, some coffee, we even forgot about that. We have some potatoes, we have some tenderloin, and we have some onion. And of course, for maximum filling, always prepared out in the wood. Dun, 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 dun. And I clean the potatoes a little bit. <sighs> Perfect. So, since this is science, we need to follow scientific rules. So, since I'm the only one fishing now, I'm gonna do 10 minutes of uh, natural colors and uh, 10 minutes of uh, bright colors. And then we will see if there's gonna be any difference. And some butter, always. Now it's time to start with the potatoes. See how freaking good is that looking or what? And it's time to start to cut some onions. Just wanna give them a rough sort of shop. That's an old high mouth saying, cutting boards just for losers. I think it's soon time to change to bright layers. Keep this scientific touch of the whole thing. It actually starts to smell nice here. <sighs> Missed a bite. A tiny, tiny, tiny pike. Like 30 centimeter, and now the alarm set off. Again, come on. Okay, I know this is not according to scientific rules because the alarm is set off, but I have a little pike here playing with my, my pike. Again, three takes. It's so small it can't even get it inside the mouth. There we go. <sighs> Lunch time. See you soon. He's sneaking in the woods. Look what we got here! Did you catch anything? No, I missed the bite, the pike like four times. Oh no. Same one. <laughs> oh. So what do we have here? Here we have some venison, here we have some onion, and here we have some potato. Because this ain't no basketball game, we're gonna have fine dining when Heimat is out on the water. Oh yeah, we sure do. And that's what we have here. Yeah. Ah, fuck, it's getting hot. Yeah, so this uh, should be a road there. I shot last week but I'm a bad hunter so we had to go and get the tenderloin in the local shop instead. So we have the red pearl talent up over there. Yeah. We have the lunch almost ready here. Then we have a few more hours of fishing. I feel just like this tree you know I had an idea of how this was gonna be but then everything just flipped over and it wasn't like I expected it to be. Damn. Yeah but I mean I guess that's all a part of the game that sometimes you get them and sometimes you don't. Yep. But now we're gonna try, I mean we have still quite a few hours left, so we're gonna, gonna crush it. The time has come. It's finally time, dude. This will be hopefully a very, very, very tasty experience. What's this saucy thing? Uh, mustard cream. Mustard cream? Mustard whipped cream. Is it as simple as it sounds? With yes. Cream yeah, sort, with sort, sort of. Mustard powder and some other gooey stuff. All set up for a romantic date. On an yeah. island. Yeah. Don't slip, Pontus. Don't slip. Just a few meters left. Just a few meters left. Ah. There we freaking go. Compensating for slow fishing the best way possible by an epic shore lunch. Beef Rydberg. Swedish thing, I think. So you pour the egg yolk and you're supposed to mush it around a little bit. A little bit all over the place. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dude. High motor approved. And the boat is 
beautiful there in the background. Mm. Can't be much better. Oh, <coughs> oh. That was epic, but now I need to get back to business. Fucking show me, Bushan. Come here now. I wanna cry. Uh, yeah, that was a bit, that was like four kilo fish. Oh man, I just changed to the real roach and look what a mess she did to it. I say orke mer här. I say orke inte. Fan ska man sätta på fyra dubbla. <laughs> I was about to say that I that I should put on four stingers or something to get it to stick to the hook. <laughs> this is freaking unreal, dude. That pretty much sums up this day, but I know it's important. <laughs> this is so funny, tragic. Oh my goodness, dude. Pike fishing tragedy, yeah. Hmm. All the rock, I think. Fish on! Fish on! Ah, on the whole pike! There we go! And it's a small pike. But still, my first one. Get the camera! <laughs> oui, monsieur! Broche for bright lures! Oh man, this bright color and this, uh, you know, murky or like, yeah, half bright. It's clearly visible in the water, but still, like, could be a natural bait fish or something. Merci, un petit crochet. Feels good. First pike of the day after quite some hours of grinding and casting. Now the rain is getting a little bit worse, so I think I'm gonna bring up my. Gore-Tex uh, jackets and bibs from Grundens, the downrigger, and it's just awesome for keeping it dry on days like this. Like 100% waterproof. Without... You look pretty damn sexy in that one, oh, that's yeah. the most important part. Yeah, I love them. Fish on, fish on. Nice one, nice. That's a good fish. Ah, uh, decent one. Biggest one so far. Yeah, dude. Good oh job. My God, what a take. Should we even Whee! net it? I think we should. Oh yeah, that's a nice one, dude. Woohoo! <laughs> there we freaking go. Oh yeah, that's a nice fish. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank you. Yeah, dude. There we freaking go. Oh, what a take. Boom! Baby. On the freaking road. Yeah! yeah. We fought so hard for this. <gasps> and there we have, I mean, it's no monster. Don't take, no. don't get us wrong, but. We love all fish for who they are, not for how big they are. So, and now we officially have the first fish for the, for the realistic lures on the scoreboard. That's a pretty damn cracking fish right here, buddy. Yeah, finally managed to hook one on that rope. Woohoo! Yes! Let's see if we measure it. I'm gonna say 82. What do you think about that? I would that? actually say exactly 82 as well. But let's say 81. <laughs> Well, do we have an 81 or what? You're, you're a little bit better than me, I'm guessing, but that's a cracking autumn fish right here. Oh, yeah. On the uh, McPike Real Roach. Let's get yeah. it back. So, 2 1 and some well deserved pike knuckles for the Real Roach. And myself. Let's take another one. Fish on! Fish on! Well, messing around with the trolling motor. Ah, and we have another small pike for Brightlers. Oh my goodness, dude. <laughs> but I mean, look at this. We can't really say that we're seeing a pattern already. But look at this. We have three pike on Brightlers. They're all like this size and yeah. a little bit bigger. And we have one fish on this. Uh, now you should really put on the, the bigger size on uh, of uh, that real pike. Oh yeah, it's a uh, smoking hot pike. We'll see, I I'll, might do that soon. Small but beautiful, and it's 3-1. Three, 3-1? One. Three, one. Yeah. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Nice bite marks on this one. Mmm. Oof. Juicy. Let's go in there, huh? 
Nej, det var ganska långt ut också. Butterfish! Butterfish! Oh! This is a nice fish, man. Ooh. Like this is a nice fish. I haven't seen it. Ah, uh, a monster, but similar size. Ooh. No, you're. That's a nice this fish. This is a big too. one. Oh yeah. Two casts in a row. Here comes the With savior, the dude. Oh. Can you do it by yourself? Such oh. a nice fish. Pour it in here. Yeah. No. <laughs> Pulling them in. <laughs> Just howling them in. I mean, where is rain weather coming in? Now we have sun instead. And the pikes just woke up. Have a look at this. Well, I said 81 about the last one. You said 82. I think now this might be the 82 we were talking about. <laughs> no, that's longer. That's longer. Oh, yeah. A low little pike. Look at those teeth. Yeah. You don't want to mess with them. Would you have a look at this one? Oh, yeah. This is slightly bigger. Bam. And that take was sick. Completely different from the other takes we had in the morning. Now, yeah, they bam. really started like, to eat now. Now they're feeding. Perfectly hooked in the side of the mouth. Boom, Gamakatsu did the trick. And now let's just see how long. Well, we, we're just nailing them now. Yeah, Not I mean, losing any fish. I wonder what happened. Yeah, bam, bam, bam. But the strikes are completely different. I have no idea why. And okay, that's a longer one, yeah. Oh, 82. that's so sick. 82. <laughs> <laughs> there is somewhere on some GoPro that Pontus just said, this is the 82 we got. <laughs> <laughs> this is the 82 we were talking about. <laughs> okay, so with a natural bait you get 81, with this bright one you get 82. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Okay. So oh man, what a day this is turning out to be. Okay. There we go, dude. Now Boom. I want to fish. Yeah. I mean, look at this one. On this uh, gator rod. I mean that that strike and that fight, two casts in a row, sick. Boom. Boom. I mean hot pike is one of my favorite colors. I mean the traditional hot pike and this realistic kind of version did not make that worse. I really like it now. I love it when you have confidence in the learning color. Oh, I'm so glad that he's taken it. So we have a fish fan. Fish on. Oh yes! Fish number four for Brightlers. Ka-ching! Smoking it at the moment, dude! And every freaking pike! We hooked all of them! The water actually was a little bit murkier in this bay. So, feels really good with this kind of Brightler. Whoop, back you go! Uh, how long is it until the painting time? Oh, I think it's like just a few minutes. Because I don't but. know if it's either you or if it's the color. <laughs> so in 10 minutes we're gonna see. Yeah. Okay, a few more casts with this, then I think it's changing time. Yep. There we go. Alarm set off. Changing time. Changing time. Well, thank you. Well, I have very high belief in this one, the motor oil right. perch. Yeah. So now it's uh, motor oil perch versus pink trout. Let's go. Come on now. Pink perch. Oh, how this perch looks good in this water and the sun. Ah, ha, 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 I'm gonna catch something soon. Ooh! Both sides take another, this is a 78! <laughs> Jesus Christ, dude, I'm still rigging. <laughs> but now we know for sure that it's the... Ooh. You're so on freaking fire right now. I am so on fire. That take was sick. Oh my freaking God. Oh, not so little pike. 
She's long. She's long. <laughs> it might be longer than other ones. Boom. <laughs> there we freaking go. Yeah, dude. <sighs> oh, sick. We're killing it, dude. We are killing it. Another nice and healthy, quite long fish. I said 78 or 76, but I think we're, I actually was a little bit wrong for once. <laughs> First time today. <laughs> but it's, well. <laughs> 83! It's 83! It's 83! So now we have 81, 82, 83. <laughs> Is that sick or what? Head over to slow-mo because this one is gonna go like a rocket. Boom! But now uh, that pike makes it 5-2. Uh, 5-2, five, two. Five, two. yeah. Now we're not doing the ultra clear water really anymore, but... It's, no, but it's still clear. It's still clear. It's still on a, a little bit more colored water. So, so, have so sick that we took them in that order as well. <laughs> 81, 82, 83. <laughs> oh man, we fought good today. What a day we had on the water. What a day, freaking day. That slow start, oh, yeah. epic lunge, and then finding those fish in the end. And yeah. now, like. Everything else went pitch yeah. black. This is just like how life should be, you know, having a good time with your friends, eating some good food. You know, it's not always about fishing, it's about getting out, having a good time, and so did we. Yeah, I mean, that lunch definitely compensated for slow fishing we had in yeah. the morning, so if we wouldn't have caught those fish in the end, like, I would have been totally fine. Yeah. But now we did. <laughs> and now we have everything. I mean, we're yeah. so lucky every single time we do this stuff. Yeah. And to sum it up, challenge-wise, I have lost track of this standing. Like, yeah, yeah, we, caught, we, had. we had so epic action there in the end. Yeah, but we have every fish on film, so we have, we know the score. Yeah, by, you know, it's the probably going to pop up somewhere right here. Yeah, but it, we definitely caught more fish on these bright ones. Yeah. But it's interesting, we caught the bigger fish on this natural. Yeah, lure. it was bigger with like, one centimeter. By one centimeter, that's true. Yeah, yeah. But, but uh, man, these McPikes in the new... Uh, 3D colors worked really good. I mean, look at this. They're so cool. Yeah. And this uh, this smoking hot pike with this, you know, chatras belly, yeah. you know, bright in one way. You were smoking hot with that I one were smoking this hot. evening. Yeah, I mean, the combination of having this bright base and natural, realistic painting was, like, sick. Yeah, we're definitely going to fish more with those ones. Yeah, for sure. So, yeah, that was it for today. Yeah, what we... Say, what do you say? Maybe we should give away some of these. I mean, we actually have some unopened packages of these that yeah. Alba sent us. Let's give away those. Let's give away five of those McPike packages. So yeah. let us know in the comments why you would want one of these. Yeah. Especially those realistic colors. And uh, yeah, we'll pick five of you. Yeah, we want to thank once again Abu Garcia for sponsoring this video. You guys rock. Yeah. Before ending this video, I hope to meet as many as possible of you guys at the sport fishing show in Sweden, Sport Fiskemassan in March. Yeah, it will be in Stockholm this year, so it's really close to all the airports. And last year we had such a good time. Yeah. And we hope that we will meet as many of you guys as possible there this year. Yeah, it's uh, late March, so it's perfect to combine with fishing yeah. in uh, Stockholm and southern parts of Sweden. Yeah. So that's, that's a really good tip to go to Sweden, combine a fishing trip with a yeah. fair. And uh, yeah, bring a couple of buddies and come up to us. Yeah, it's we're gonna, gonna have, we're gonna have fly with the finale. Yeah, and we're gonna have a lot of cool stuff in our booth as well. Yeah, can't as really, always. Can't really talk about all of it no, now. No, uh, gotta keep a few stuff secret. Mm, yeah, we got some yeah. cool stuff coming. But up. now I think it's time for us to head home because uh, time <laughs> flew away and it's pitch black outside. We're not gonna find the boat launch. Uh, we're, we're, we're like, the, yeah. Luckily, we have the Solix. Solix, but without it, we would be pretty damn screwed. Yeah. It's like actually pitch black outside. Yeah. But thank you guys so much for watching. We have had a great, great time on the water, yeah. my dear friend. That lunch was epic. Yeah, and we will be back next week with more epic fishing videos. So yeah. have a good weekend, and we we'll see you guys next week. Yeah. Make sure to subscribe if you like what we do. Check out this one and this one. They're really good. Yeah. And yeah, we'll see you in the next video. You guys rock. Ciao. Ciao.